talk to me in terms of different, different ways of what you use a swimming session for? Well, I use it a lot in the off-season. You don't want to be on the bike um, week in, week out for the whole season. If you uh, swim for a couple of months, it's, it's a good way to have a break and it's also a fantastic way to keep in, in, uh, in shape, you know. It works everything, including your lungs, you know. Mm -hmm. I don't think there's anything that really can keep you as fit as swimming does. So, so lungs are really, really important and that's a great way, a great workout in the water. Legs, clearly I know you need good legs from the bike but you sometimes need to rest them or sometimes you need to work them out in the water. Yeah, I mean, obviously if you, if you get on a kickboard and, and uh, you know, use it as active recovery, you know, it's, it's no impact at all on the legs, which is it's also good. So you use it for recovery, you use it for a workout, you use your arms every now and again, because I know a lot of people, there's this great myth about, I've got quite big shoulders, but I was a swimmer, but there's a great myth, people go, oh, I don't want to swim, and I guess cyclists, because it's all about weight, they don't want to swim because yeah. they're afraid they're going to get this big upper body. I think that's the thing is um, some cyclists are a little bit scared to get into the pool as you know um, it's, it's a powder uh, weight sport and uh, I can tell you from my experience when, when I was uh, swimming the most I don't think I gained anything in the upper body. Um, I think it is a bit of a myth that you know cyclists shouldn't swim. It's uh, you know mentally as well it's such a great way to, to stay fit. So Richard, you're a professional cyclist, um, but what would you sort of say to the everyday, you know, I don't know, a weekend rider or someone that sort of likes to take part, likes to get on the bike every now and again and a person that likes to take part in a Sunday competition? Yeah, I don't think it matters what level cyclist you are. I mean, fitness is fitness, you know, if you, if you pull fit, then surely, you know, that translates onto the bike as well. So, yeah, it's, it's something that, um, you know, I think cyclists of all abilities, you know, and, and fitness, should do is uh, you know change it up a bit do something different and get in the pool